today I'm doing a video that has been highly requested actually. I'm gonna go through my closet, I'm going to get rid of a ton of stuff that I just don't wear anymore, and then I'm gonna show you some of my favorite pieces. I'm gonna try them on, and yeah, come along on this journey with me. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Alexandra. So many of you have requested a closet tour. So I'm not only gonna be doing a closet tour today, but I am going to be decluttering and clearing out my wardrobe. I have one closet in this apartment, um, and this closet holds my linens, my towels, um, other random things like possibly a Christmas tree um, and then of course all of my clothes so because we're all stuck inside it's week two of self isolating self distancing I'm in like full spring declutter mode I just want to get rid of everything in my house probably because I've been living in it and haven't left for seven straight days also I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for being here um, I'm really trying hard to keep my social media channels and this channel as positive as possible. And I hope that you can take 15 minutes out of this crazy world that we live in and feel more inspired, um, at peace and relaxed as possible. I know what will instantly make you feel more relaxed and content. Hold on. Say hi, Mrs. Say hi, Mrs. Okay. So this is my closet um, and I wanted to give just a quick decor tip. Um, when I made over this bedroom, I did a whole video on it, I'll link it up here. I painted this closet a beautiful like dusty pink color, it's my favorite color pink. And I just think it adds like such a cute pop of color into the space. You guys, I'm so embarrassed to show you the inside of my closet. Oh dear, oh dear, oh no. <laughs> thing I do really love clothing I love style I think it really influences the choices that I make in design sometimes that being said I do not like shopping I find it really difficult to find things that feel comfortable and fit me well all that being said I feel like I've narrowed down a few pieces in my wardrobe that are like staples for me so my goal for today is to really really like think hard about all of those things that I just don't wear anymore and get rid of them. And like think about the things that I actually want in my wardrobe. And I want things that, you know, I reach for every single morning. And I have a lot of things in this closet that I haven't worn in forever, but keep because I'm like, oh, it's cute. Maybe I'll wear it down the line. No, today we're just getting rid of it. So the first thing I'm gonna do is just start by taking everything out of this closet and throwing it on my bed, Marie Kondo style. Let's go. This is ridiculous. I have a lot of clothes. Okay, so this is the situation. Wow. Christmas tree, suitcase, toilet paper, random other stuff. But this, this is clear. Next, I'm going to um, take the remainder stuff out from the bottom and I'm going to give this closet a really good clean. I'm gonna vacuum it. I'm going to wipe it down with some green cleaner then start sorting through all of these clothes. Okay, so this shirt I love so much, um, but I haven't worn it in a really long time. I'm gonna put this and this to the side, and then I'm gonna do a try on at the end of all the things that I'm not sure about. These are maybes, I'm gonna put these in a pile. I love this. So this is a really long maxi dress. Um, I randomly found this at American Eagle last summer. I'm gonna pop in a photo of me wearing this in Morocco. Um, just such a classic piece that's like really easy to wear in the summer. So I'm definitely gonna keep this. Okay, just a plain black t-shirt. 
This one's from Gap. I bought a bunch of these in black and white. Um, they're really soft. I will try and link these ones down below, but if you're looking for just like a really simple t-shirt that's really soft, this one is a great pick. So I'm gonna put this as a t-shirt section. For some reason, I'm just sick of this color. And I don't know why, because it's a perfectly great sweater. I'm gonna put this aside as a maybe, but yeah, I just like, I don't grab it as much as I grab the black, and then I have a white in this as well. Um, so I'm gonna put this to the side. I love this sweater. This is from Zara last season. Really like textured and adorable. So I'm gonna leave this in the closet under sweaters for next season. I got this at Target not too long ago. I just don't love it, to be honest. It was great while we were in Florida. I'm gonna give this away as well. Put in the donation pile. This is um, one of my favorite sweaters. It's from Target. I'm not sure if they still have them in store, but I got it in this color and this color. They're just so warm, so, so soft on the inside, um, and just like really easy to throw on and wear every day. So I'm gonna definitely keep these. I've been wearing them with um, my Lululemon Align leggings, which I'm wearing today. Okay, next item. Okay, definitely giving this away. Um, this is from Zara. It has a really cute um, like little hem here and then it floats out. It's not flattering on me at all, at all. So I'm giving this away. I donate all of my clothes to a local charity. It's a women's shelter and I've been donating to them forever. Um, I always, yeah, give them to family or friends or donate them just as an FYI, is a summer dress. It's from uh, Uniqlo, actually, and it comes with a slip underneath. I just don't know where the slip is, but um, you can wear it on your, uh, like as a duster, so on its own, like open, um, or as a dress, which is really, really pretty. So I'm gonna keep this. So I'm doing this in the closet right now, just creating different sections. So skirts, dresses, t-shirts, and sweaters. Next item, these are the Align leggings that I was telling you guys about. Um, now these are pretty expensive, um, not gonna lie, but such an amazing investment. What I will say is that if you wash them, make sure you wash them on delicate, make sure you wash them inside out, and make sure you do not put them in the dryer. Um, I made that mistake with this pair and they do not dry well in the dryer at all. So they're a little like, beat up but I'm definitely gonna keep them because I can wear them on those days when I'm not like seeing anyone or on a weekend or whatever so I'm definitely gonna keep these I weirdly hang my pants up in the closet in my closet um, even though I have a full dresser I just I don't know I just like all my clothes being together so yeah these are going in next item is from a store called shop beautifully you so they carry sizes extra small to plus sizes which is really awesome the owner sends me um some of their new pieces every season like this cute sweater really adorable um definitely gonna keep this in my in my sweater section okay, this is another shop beautifully you sweater like how adorable guys you guys ask me about this sweater so much. Um, it is quite literally a pom-pom sweater and I've worn it many times. I love it so much. And again, it's just like a fun piece to layer. It's like different, you know? Uh, the one thing I will say is that it's very chunky. So it's a good sweater for spring um, over winter, I would say, because in the winter I found like I couldn't put a jacket over it because it was just too bulky. So yeah, definitely a good, spring piece to layer adorable these jeans are from j crew i love them so much they have a bit of flare at the bottom i've worn these a lot so you guys have probably seen them in videos definitely keeping these um i would never have gone for a flare a flare cut but i was working with a stylist for a while and she was like definitely try the flare cut and i did and i love them so these are going in the closet. The next piece is from Mod Cloth, and it's this adorable printed dress. It has like a layered little bottom to it. It's really, really cute. It's like this cute floral pattern. This is my TV dress, so I wear it on TV because it's really bright and fun. So I'm definitely gonna keep this. 
another skirt I think I'm going to donate this because it's really cute it's like textured and it kind of flares out but I didn't wear it at all this season and I think someone else can get better wear out of it, it feels so good to get rid of stuff um, I just recently got this beautiful dress from Aritzia and the back has like a hole there um, and it has a really like deep slit at the front which is really flattering at the end I'm gonna do like a try on of my favorite items so yeah I'll try this one on another just like dropping clothes everywhere another staple of mine are these smash and test rompers people are always like where did you get your pajamas slash onesie um these are from smash and test I have three of them I have black green and a purple one um this is total loungewear but in the spring and the summer I think it's totally fine to wear it out if you dress it up with like a cute flat or a mule and a leather jacket um but yeah super flattering and really cozy you guys this is the my most favorite piece of clothing um in my closet right now i just got it it's also from the gap i really like the gap <laughs> and it's this really adorable stripy jumpsuit i was so hesitant about ordering this online without trying it but it is so comfortable like so so comfortable it has these cute little frills the legs are kind of flared I am all for those things that look really pretty but feel comfortable so if you guys have any suggestions on like pieces in your closet that are staples that you love that you know you're gonna wear again and again please link them in the comments for me and for everyone else watching because I just need more pieces like this in my life okay next up little plug here I have a merch line it's all themed around cats so it says sorry I can't I have plans with my cat in this really cute script and then this one says the same thing in a more like bright pink the best part about this merch line is that it's ethical it's made of organic cotton and for every purchase made, 10% uh, goes to charity. And my charity is Right to Play, which is a children's charity. The link will be down below. I know right now because of the whole COVID-19 situation, you can still order from the shop. It's just that um, you won't receive it for a few weeks. I love pairing them with jeans, obviously, to be casual, but they look really great tucked into skirts or shorts for the summer super cute and they're so soft i've washed these so many times and they just get like softer and softer with every wash which is ideal you know this is a piece that i just really want to keep but i never wear it because i just don't find it that flattering on me um it's a really long cheetah print skirt from h m i love it but it just i, I never end up wearing it because i just i don't like the way it looks on me so donating that it's like even if you like something hanging hanging up if you don't feel good in it you're never gonna wear it right okay definitely keeping this this is the infamous dot dress I've worn this so many times but I just love it so so much I have a white one as well it's from Zara um, I'm sure they still have it in stock this dress went like viral last summer because everyone had it um, there's an Instagram called hot for the dot <laughs> which basically just snaps pictures of people in this dress so I have it in this color and then I also have it in a white color. Really easy for the spring and summer. I love to pair this with Converse, with my white Converse. It's just super cute. Next up, this is a maybe. It's this olive green blouse. It's a maybe because like I just never wear it and I don't know what I'd pair it with. So I'm gonna put this to the side. I'm gonna try it on at the end, see if I like it. Definitely keeping this. It's just a really long duster. The texture on it is so pretty. And just great to wear with like a t-shirt and jeans. I love it. So many of you asking me about my overalls. They're from The Gap. Definitely size down in these. I'm an extra small. Um, they fit very big. I have a painting pair and then a non-painting pair. How fun is this jacket? This is also from Mod Cloth. I'm gonna give this a try because I honestly haven't worn it because I don't know what to wear it with. So I'm gonna try it, see what I can pair it with. It's super cute. I love this dress. I can't wait to wear it this summer. It's from Target. So cute. So I just finished organizing my clothes. I have a huge bag of things to give away. So I have my dresses here. I have jeans, overalls, button-down shirts, t-shirts, long dusters 
loungewear, sweaters, and jackets. And I'm feeling pretty good about it. It's like amazing how much lighter I feel. Now I'm going to deal with all of this linen that I have on the bed. Um, I do store it in here. I'm just gonna refold it all um, and also give away anything that's old, like old pillowcases. Okay, this is a hack that you guys probably already do. I'm putting my fitted sheet into a pillowcase along with the other matching pillowcase. So that now they're not gonna get all tangled up. And when I change the bed, I know where everything is. Not the most ideal spot, but what are you gonna do? Almost there. And now I'm gonna try on all of those items that I'm not quite sure about. Okay. This is, no, <laughs> this is from The Gap. Um, on the hanger, it looked really cute, but these sleeves are just like way too poofy. Like, absolutely not. Not happening, no. The next is this dotted wrap top. I think I'm actually gonna keep this. I think it's really cute. Um, I love how it has such a long tie. Just cute with like high-waisted jeans. Yeah, maybe a skirt. It's cute. Love it. I don't know. It's it's like cute in theory and I really like the color, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know. Let me know in the comments. This I feel like is cute. Maybe not everyone's taste, but um, it's just like quirky and cute. And on the back it has this bow. Again, I'm wearing the wrong bra, but I think in the summer this could be really nice, tucked into shorts or jeans. Yeah, I think I'm gonna give this, I think I'm gonna give this one more go. It's cute, I just haven't given it a chance, you know? Okay, <laughs> this is another one of those shirts that I'm like, I really wanna love it. Like look at these cute bows, it's different. On the back it has buttons going all the way down. I don't know, it's like a little bit extra, you know? Can't tell, guys let me know in the comments. Is this just like a no or is it cute and different? This is the polka dotted pom pom jacket that I wanted to show you guys. I got this from Mod Cloth. I'll link it down below. It's just like so fun, just so fun. And I think this is gonna be a good spring piece to have in my closet. I feel like it's a little bit dressy, it's cute. Okay, so now is the part of the video where I'm gonna show you guys some of my closet faves, some things I've just bought and um, I'm loving for spring. Hopefully this whole pandemic calms down so we can all go out in our cute spring outfits and just be back to normal again. Okay, here's the first one. So this is the jumpsuit that I was talking about when I was clearing everything out from the Gap. How cute! It's flared at the bottom. A little bit tighter here, have these cute ruffles, and it's in this cute little pinstripe. And guys, this is so, so comfy, like super comfortable. Um, it's really soft, really like stretchy. Yeah, I love it. I love it. This is the next dress from Ritzia. This would be so good for a spring or summer wedding. Um, it has this like, open area at the back. Um, it's super flattering on like the tummy area. It also has this deep slit at the side, which yeah, it just makes it a little more like flattering. I would obviously wear this with heels, but yeah, super pretty in this super cute floral pattern. But, yeah, love this. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and decluttering my closet with me. I hope that it motivates you to get organizing um, while we're all inside. I mean, what else is there to do, right? Then organize your entire house. 
Um, I can't wait until you see the video that's going up on Saturday. I am making over, or I made over my entire living room. Um, and I didn't leave the house once to do it, which is crazy. And it looks entirely different. I'm really excited about it. So tune in on Saturday. And then the following Wednesday, I'll be doing another vlog like this, decluttering my loft which I've already organized, I know, um, except it got like wildly out of hand very quickly. And I've taken some of the suggestions that you guys wrote in the comments of that previous loft organizing video and implemented them, which is very exciting. Okay, I hope you guys um, are staying sane and safe and I will see you on Saturday. Bye.